Soccer season is canceled for some Metro families, and now as 41 Action News reporter Mackenzie Nelson shares, some parents are asking questions after they were not given refunds for their participation fees. Parents and coaches are frustrated with Sporting Blue Valley, a soccer league here in Overland Park that canceled its spring season due to COVID-19, but didn't issue families any refund. They just said that uh, due to these times, um, they are not able to offer a refund. And does it. Brandon Kramer is not the only parent that says they received a similar email. The message is, I'm sorry, there is not a refund, but we'll see you in the fall. That's the message that we're getting. The recreational soccer season would have started in mid-March and gone through April. Teams told 41 Action News they never had the chance to play a game or even practice before stay-at-home orders were put in place. My problem is there's no refund, and I feel like we did not get to play. We did not get new jerseys. We did not use the field time at all. That's my issue. Expecting a refund, parents say they didn't find out until last week that a $50 credit would be put on their account when they register for the fall season if there is one. I'm disappointed with the lack of compassion that we're showing as a community when we shouldn't when we should all be coming together. Most parents told 41 Action News they paid $85 per child for the rec team and more competitive teams cost more. According to the Sporting Blue Valley website, all requests for refunds must be emailed in prior to the start of the season. Teams say they want to know where their money went. And in my mind, it's there for the kids to have fun and get together and appreciate the sport. Um, and when st stuff like this happens, it makes you think that that's not necessarily the goal of the organization. Sporting Blue Valley has not responded to our requests for comment, and parents say in emails that Sporting Blue Valley called this a fluid situation, and they would update them as plans became more concrete. And as for parents, I'm told they are looking for other leaks to put their children in. Reporting in Overland Park, Mackenzie Nelson, 41 Action News.